On March 3rd, California will be participating in the DNC primary with 14 other states to make up Super Tuesday, the most important day of the DNC primary election. However, California's primary has not always had this much weight and has refreshed importance in the DNC primary of 2020. Until 1994, California held its primary elections in June, but still occasionally hosted competitive primaries, including tight races on the Democratic side in 1968, 1984, and 1992. The state's primary was permanently moved to March with the Primetime Primary Act in 2017. So what does this mean for voters? California is the most diverse state in the U.S., sends the highest number of delegates to the Electoral College, and has the fifth largest economy in the world. So moving the primary date three months earlier could be more than transformative in the political realm. With this earlier election date, California will now have a stronger voice in choosing nominees for each party. On top of this, candidates will now have to seriously campaign in California, like other state primaries, like in Iowa, New Hampshire, and the Carolinas meaning they will take on the issues that matter to Californians. Additionally, voters who are registered with a certain party will now have more say in the process of their party's presidential candidate, which is not very relevant with a June primary date. Overall, a March 3rd California primary will finally give Californians some deserved importance during the presidential primary season, which has been long overdue. As a California voter, you should be happy that your state will now carry greater importance in choosing your party's presidential candidate. This has been Aiden Buzo from Loyola and Election Team.